protected by UNESCO, so it's a world uh, history heritage. Uh, we are now leaving Split. Uh, on the way to Dubrovnik we will make two stops. Uh, first will be a coffee <coughs> break and also a stop for uh, restrooms, which will be soon after we reach uh, the highway, the expressway to Dubrovnik. And the other one, uh, the second stop will be made uh, in front of the bridge uh, that is connected to the peninsula Pelješac, which is the most <coughs> southern peninsula of Croatia with the mainland and it's also connecting uh, whole Croatia because if you take a look on the map you will see that there is one small bit of uh, Croatian Adriatic coast which is divided by Bosnian territory. This Bosnian territory is called the Neu and this was the part that back in the 14th century uh, Republic of Dubrovnik uh, gave away as a present to Ottoman Empire. So historically it always belonged to the Ottoman Empire and that's the reason why in that constitution of 1974 that I mentioned yesterday talking about Yugoslavia and Tito, uh, according to that uh, constitution when the new map of Yugoslavia was made, uh, Bosnia and Herzegovina also got this small part of uh, Croatian Adriatic coast. They don't have an entrance to the um, open sea but they do have uh, the coast and the beaches over there. So with building of this bridge that we're gonna see that is also the biggest bridge in whole Croatia, we will in fact uh, also see... Um, so the bridge is the biggest one in Croatia and we will uh, have a chance to see it and uh, then we're gonna cross it and then uh, continue to uh, Dubrovnik. So in front of that bridge, unfortunately, there are no uh, facilities. It was uh, funded uh, with the money from uh, European Union and uh, for the first few years nothing commercial was allowed to build there and uh, this several few years have to pass. After that maybe there will be a cafe, but uh, for now there are only uh, restaurants. So this will be our two stops and uh, soon after that we will reach uh, Dubrovnik. When we get to the hotel I will also explain you how to use uh, the bus. So those who will want to go uh, to the city center in uh, this evening either before or after dinner uh, can uh, use it. The bus is number four, but also how to use it and so on. Uh, I'll explain you uh, later. You need uh, roughly 15 minutes to reach the city center of the Brovnik by bus. So, enjoy the ride and uh, see you soon.